What is up guys, it's Razor, and welcome back to Empty Bottle and Default Armor Challenge Run of Body Out of Stories. As you can tell, I got the Empty Bottle and the Handmade Tunic equipped. This is the, the previous default armor was the Knight's Attire, but it changed to the Homemade Tunic. So this is going to be the new default armor that we wear. So I will not be changing... I will not, will not be changing the handmade tunic throughout the entire game. So, but this was, I think, what was it called before? Knight's Attire or something like that? Knight's Attire had like 8 defense, I think. This only has 5 defense. So it's actually worse than Jack's previous armor. But yeah, this is going to be the new default. We're going to be using that throughout the entire game. And the empty bottle, of course. Which has a strength of one, which you already know. But anyway, in the last episode, we were disbanded from the knights. And we made our way here to the pub in near Theater Van Core. And Jack is actually going to be trying out for Theater Van Core. So is Gans. So I believe we can... No, you can't kick him. Okay. So I think we have to talk to everybody around here, I believe. I ain't some booze, no punk. Get out of here. How rude. Well, I guess he'd kind of lose his job. If he gave an underage person boo, so I could understand why he says to get out of here. Hi. Yep, first time here. Well, not my first time here, but Jack's first time here in this particular playthrough. Hi. You can actually kick the little her. And so summon guards. Let's see if we can take out the guards. We actually haven't fought these guards yet, so let's let's analyze them. Uh, keep in mind, uh, if you fight these guardsmen, there's a chance you'll fight higher level guardsmen. So you actually have to be careful with that. Like you like. We're fighting level 6 heavy guardsmen right now. But later in the game, you'll actually fight higher level guards. So you gotta be careful kick dueling certain people. Because if you kick those certain higher up people, you'll fight higher level guards. So there's something to keep in mind. And these guards like to call them backup too, which is pretty annoying. So you want to try to get rid of them as quickly as possible. Obviously if you didn't have an empty bottle equipped you could probably kill them in like two hits. But since I only got an empty bottle, it takes me a lot longer to kill to, to defeat them. Don't come near me. What's up, how's it going? Oh, the drinks are great. That's good. Yeah, she owns the accessory shop in uh, Roddy Out of Town, whatever. Oh, Warrior, Warrior Town. Okay, whatever. Okay, Hertz. Uh, keep her in mind f uh, for later as well. I'm not going to spoil what... Uh, she is, but you'll you, we'll find out about her later on. I want to talk to Gans. Thank you. Yeah, let's head to Theater Van Core for a cutscene. Well, here we are. We'll be fine, Jack. Let's just stay loose.
Hey there, we're here to enlist. And who are you? I am Captain Gans Rothschild, formerly of the Rose Corshaw Brigade. This is my former subordinate, Master Jack Russell. Today we retired from the Royal Knights and came directly here to apply to your organization. Yeah? Okay, Tubbs, you're on the third floor. The kid goes to the second. Move it. You want to take the test, right? Uh, now? We don't have time for hoity-toity night ceremonies here. Now get your fingers out of your noses and hop to it. Y yes, sir! Gee, what happened to staying loose? Oh, yeah. Tubbs will be with Gerald, our second-in-command. You get Sergeant Caesar, squirt. What kind of outfit is this? Alright, so Gans has to go to the third floor. He gets like a higher up decision than what Jack gets. Let's go in this room before we head in the other room. Hello. So Alicia, Hello. her story is kind of like a mystery, like I still haven't figured out her story, like, I know part of her story, but it's like, we'll find out more about it later, but I'm just confused about her whole storyline. Like, her story's very vague. Like, you don't unravel her entire mystery. But, yeah, she has one, she has a... She has a mystery, let's just say that. Anyway, cutscene. It's open. Whoa! How did he know I was here? Uh, yeah. Hi. You are an applicant. What is your name? Oh, Jack Russell. Very well, Jack. I would like to ask you a simple question. Why do you wish to join Theater Van Core? Well, I got fired from the Knights. Hmm. An unusually frank young man. Is he just a fool? Or is there more to him? Hmm? Next question. Imagine this situation. You have been sent on a very dangerous mission. And you find yourself alone. The rest of your party lies dead. What do you do? What do I do? I'm not really sure I get your point exactly. Hmm. Huh. Hmm. Huh. That is the end of my test. Please proceed to Deputy Gerald's room on the third floor. Jack. Yeah? All men must die. Yeah, that's for sure. I get... Gee. What kind of test was that? He shows no tenacity of purpose and exhibits no fear of death. An intriguing young man. So that was, uh, that was Caesar. He's like a samurai character. And he's pretty mysterious as well. I always like Caesar as a character though, he's pretty cool. He's not one of my favorites, but he's pretty cool. Most of my favorite characters in this game are like terrible though. I may do a top 10 list, or a top 20 list of my favorite characters. Since there's 177 characters, I could probably make a top 20 list. But anyway, another cutscene. Hey, you trying to kill me? <laughs> you managed to dodge. All right, then. Let's continue. Huh? Aren't you taking the test? Oh yeah, right. 
You swinging that sword at me kind of knocked me off track. Hmm. Minus three points. What? You allowed yourself to become flustered. During that time, three of your allies were slain. Therefore, minus three points. Oh, come on, no way! In war, there is no time for cowardice or incompetence. Now, if you're ready, we'll go to the training ground. Today, you get special treatment. If you can beat me in combat, you will pass the test and be able to proceed. You mean like a practical exam? All right, that's more like it. You'd better be sure you're ready. I won't be holding back. All right, so another battle. This time it's against Gerald, and uh, you cannot actually win this battle. As you can tell, he's level 44, his specials blaze, and his HP is a question mark, so don't even bother to try to beat him. I get some few hits in on him. He hits very hard as you can tell. Yeah, we lose. Yeah, you can't win that battle, so don't don't even worry about it. You didn't run away. I'm impressed. Oh man, I didn't even come close to winning. What did you expect, fool? I was a swordsman years before you were born. Now get on your feet. You have to go up to the fourth floor and see the boss. Huh? I like your guts, boy. You've passed. Now get moving. Uh, yes, sir! Hmm. You're looking more like a soldier already. Thanks to me, of course. It's been a while since we've had someone like him in the guild. Uh, so yeah, Gerald. Uh, Gerald's always been a cool character. And Gerald is actually a missable character in this game too, so... Trying to kick everything around here, make sure there's no items or anything like that. Startle powder, better than nothing. I believe you can actually kick. Oh, you can't. Okay, never mind. I thought you could kick him sitting down. I guess not. I'll go visit the chief in a second, dude. Chill. So the chief's actually up on the fourth floor. <laughs> Alright, so there'll be another cutscene as soon as I uh, examine the door. Uh, the chief's actually a really cool character as well, so you're about to be able to See her. Gerald is quite a fighter, isn't he? Oh yeah, I've never fought anyone who was that good before. I'm telling you, it was pretty wild. You, you may be the one. We can use you. Excellent! You won't regret this! Wait till you see what I can do! Do not misunderstand me, Jack. You are still very weak. Huh? You were defeated by Gerald, were you not? Yeah, but I'll beat him soon. Sure, he's better than me now, but just you wait! Impossible. Hmm? Say what? You lack real strength, because you wield your sword only for yourself. Remember this, only those who fight to protect another are able to acquire true strength. 
fight to protect another, huh? Hmm. This completes the tests. See Thanos at the first floor reception and he'll explain our procedures. Sure. So you passed. Easy peasy. That tubby guy you came with failed. What? No way. The captain didn't make it? Nope. Oh, man. Anyway, I guess you need to know where you're staying. Grab your stuff and follow me. This is it. Where? Where is it? Huh? Are you serious? This is it? Tomorrow you'll be assigned to a unit. Be at the guild first thing in the morning, and don't be late. Later. The benefits aren't what I thought they'd be. Speaking of which... I wonder where the captain is. Hey, captain! Um, Master Jack! I was just resting here, enjoying the evening breeze. Captain, I heard you didn't pass the test. Ah, yes, that's right. I, I wasn't feeling my best, and you know... <laughs> I suppose I shouldn't have had that drink beforehand. I really thought... We were going to be working together again. So, Master Jack, you passed, did you? Yeah. I is that right? <laughs> Wonderful! Well done, Master Jack! Excellent, excellent! Captain? Yes? What are you gonna do now? Oh, I'll think of something. There are lots of other guilt, you know. I'll be in touch as soon as I've settled down. Don't you worry about me now. Make sure you do your best for Theater Van Corp. But Captain... Ah, uh, yes. There was one thing that I wanted to ask you. What's that? Well, it's about my father. Hmm? No, forget it. It doesn't matter. Goodbye, Master Jack. Take care. Lady Ridley, you're back on your feet. I asked you where Jack was. He left the castle sometime last night. No. Father. Huh? Ridley? What's wrong? Why are you so upset? Why did you have the brigade disbanded? Why did you have those two fired? What are you talking about? The knights are Lord Locke's responsibility. Who are you trying to please? Your daughter or yourself? But my sweet, now you're captain of your own brigade, with the very best knights under your command. I never asked for that. It's not what I wanted. Ridley, what's wrong, Ridley? Nothing. I'm fine. I'm just feeling a little dizzy. Oh, right. This isn't the castle. Yikes! I've got to get to Vancouver! Alright, so Ridley is looking for Jack. 
She's pretty upset that uh, Jasney got Jack disbanded from the Knights. And we gotta head to Theater Vancouver. I believe at this point we can start recruiting characters. Or no, we can't yet. But in the next episode, we'll probably be able to start recruiting people. So in the next episode, we shall do that. So I want to thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned for the next episode. And later.